Hi guys, this is the Anarchist. I've decided to start a new segment to my channel. I'm going to call it Cards to Consider. It's aimed mostly at budget players, but anybody can use this. There will most likely be common cards, but they're cards that you may consider main decking or side decking, depending on your locals meta or what's going on and everything else, and uh, what decks are popular at the moment. So yeah, to start this off, please like, subscribe, and check out my other videos, especially my binders. But yeah, first card, Chaos End. Now, if you read the effect, you can only activate this card if it will focus. Ooh, yeah, only activate this card when seven or more cards of your cards are removed from play to destroy our monsters on the field. So it's a dark hole. Ah, but when are you going to get seven cards removed? But if you're playing a, I don't know, Dragon Ruler deck or Light Sworn Ruler deck or any Dragon Ruler deck or any deck that banishes, you've just got an extra dark hole. And you can play three of these on top of Dark Hole. Well, it's not exactly hard to banish seven cards. That's four Dragon Ruler summons and you've got eight. So, yeah, you've just summoned a load of Dragon Rulers on the field. They've stopped your play somehow. And you go, okay, Dark Hole. It's a spell card as well, so it's not going to be wiretapped. It's... I think at three at the moment as well. So you can have four dark holes, yeah? Who needs judgment dragon? You just got four dark you got four dark holes. You can who needs Exoton either actually. <laughs> You've just got a card that will replace Exoton or Judgment Dragon because it's an extra dark hole. But hey. Yeah. So don't forget to like, subscribe. What do you think of this card? Comment if would you use it sort of thing? Anyway, the Anarchist, signing out.